Hey everybody, how's it going? Bill Moore back again with another fresh pod review from my friend Ed Curry and the Pucker Butt Pepper Company. Home of the world's hottest pepper. All right. And the one I'm going to be reviewing today uh, is a cross, another cross that he is working on. And he says this is a cross between a lemon pepper and a naga. Um, I don't know um, how many years uh, into the um, cross or that it's been, so um, but this is a cross between a lemon pepper and a naga. Beautiful looking pepper, nice red color. Does feel like this is going to be nice and crunchy. Uh, so let's uh, let's just get into this. I'm going to go ahead and um, pop off the uh, the stem here. And we're just going to munch on this thing like this, okay? I'll start here at the top. Here we go. Mmm. Right off the bat, does have a very flavorful taste on this very sweet juicy fruity very juicy maybe a slight citrus taste to it slightly fruity very crunchy and very juicy is the best way I can describe it. It's not floral, it's not bitter. All right, it definitely is um, lit up the mouth a little bit, a um, little bit all over the, um, the tongue, sides of the mouth. Nothing too crazy so far but a really good flavor on that one but a pretty good burn on it nothing nothing super hot uh, yet seems to be focused mainly on the um, kind of the front of the mouth a little bit uh, maybe the uh, underneath the gums in the front nothing on the back of the throat not too much on the tongue just kind of all over the insides of the mouth the gums under the tongue just a little bit in the front definitely i would put this i would put this in the um, maybe the same heat level as a hmm maybe a real hot jalapeno um, or definitely maybe a hot serrano pepper so it's definitely hotter than a jalapeno for sure um, but not not even near close to habanero heat level um, but a nice um, it seems maybe slightly stingy not too stingy but just a nice uh, kind of a, 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 a warm burn uh, in the places that I described so far I think it's definitely peaked. It's not getting any worse. Um, but that is a very flavorful pepper. Board, it's on the front of the mouth. Mainly it hasn't moved back or anything like that. It's not on the back of the throat. It's not really on the tongue. It just kind of seems to be front, behind the lips, around the gums, in that area. Maybe uh, slightly on top of the roof of the mouth in the front. So I'm probably going to keep this video pretty short. Doesn't even have me tearing up or anything like that. All right, so it's definitely peaked. It's coming down a little bit, but a nice, pretty good burn. Uh, once again, everybody, that was a cross that Egg Curry is working on. A uh, cross between the lemon, pepper, and the naga. Uh, that's all the information that he gave me. So I hope you enjoyed this review. Thanks a lot, Ed, for sending that. I appreciate it. Everybody, you can check Ed Curry out at the Pucker Butt 
PepperCompany.com. Once again, PuckerButtPepperCompany.com. Make sure if you're in the Carolinas, North or South Carolina, if you're traveling through, you have got to stop by Ed Curry's store on 235 Main Street. He's got seeds. He's got um, all kinds of hot sauces, his own unique uh, great line of hot sauces and salsas and, and jellies in season and popcorn. But he have, has so many other unique products from many other great companies in there as well. So make sure that you check him out. All right, everybody. I hope you enjoyed this. And until the next pot or hot sauce review, make sure you enjoy the burn. We'll see you on the next video.